the future of the Linux desktop is here. Say hello to Bluefin, a next generation Linux workstation built for reliability, performance and sustainability. Designed to seamlessly blend the simplicity of a Chromebook with the power of a full-fledged GNOME desktop. Bluefin is not just another Linux distribution. It's a complete re-imaging of how a Linux desktop should function. But what makes Bluefin different? Why should you consider switching? And how does it stand out from the sea of other Linux distributions? Stick around as we dive deep into everything you need to know about Bluefin, the Linux desktop that's built for the future. So what is Bluefin? Bluefin is a custom image of Fedora Silverblue with a desktop experience inspired by Ubuntu. It's not just another Linux distro. It's a curated, community-driven, image-based operating system designed to be as reliable as a Chromebook while still offering the power and flexibility Linux users love. For everyday users, Bluefin is a rock-solid, maintenance-free system. For developers, it's a cloud-native powerhouse that integrates modern workflows and containerized environments right off the box. Now let's talk about the unique features of Bluefin. One of the standout features of Bluefin is its flat pack first approach. Instead of relying on traditional package manager, Bluefin prioritizes applications from FlatHub, ensuring that your software is always up to date, secure and isolated from the core system. This means no dependencies, nightmares, no conflicts, just pure reliable software distribution. Another game-changing feature is automatic image-based updates. Bluefin continuously refines itself with seamless, hassle-free updates that ensures system stability without requiring manual intervention. This feature guarantees that your system stays updated without breaking your workflow. Now let's talk about for developers the cloud native experience. If you are a developer, Bluefin offers a cutting edge cloud native experience. It comes with an optional developer mode that provides container centric workflows, dev containers for VS Code, and built in support for OCI containers. With tools like DevPod, Homebrew, and a cloud native terminal, Bluefin brings the best of modern development workflows directly to your desktop, minimizing choice paralysis. Unlike traditional Linux distributions, Bluefin minimizes choice paralysis. Instead of overwhelming users with multiple software sources, it provides a streamlined experience by focusing on a well curated FlatHub store and homebrew for package management. The goal is simple, less complexity, more productivity. Comparison with other Linux distros So how does Bluefin compare to other Linux distributions? While distros like Ubuntu and Fedora offers package-based installations, Bluefin takes a different route by using OCI container features. This results in a more maintainable and consistent system experience. It behaves more like consumer-friendly appliances, making Linux accessible to a broader audience. Other Universal Blue Images Bluefin is a part of the Universal Blue family. If you prefer KDE, Aurora offers a similar experience with the KDE Plasma desktop. And for gamers, Bezite delivers an enthusiast-grade gaming setup, comparable to Steam OS. Different options but the same philosophy, modern, reliable and future-proof. So who should use Bluefin? Bluefin is ideal for three types of users. Number one, casual users who want a simple, stable and maintenance-free Linux experience. Number two, for developers who needs a powerful, container-friendly workstation. Number three, cloud engineers who prefers cloud-native workflows on their local machines. If you fall into any of this category, Bluefin might just 
be the perfect OS for you. So about the final thoughts, the Linux desktop has long struggled to break into the mainstream. But with the Bluefin, we are seeing a shift towards a modern cloud native future. If you are interested in trying out Bluefin, check out the official GitHub repository and join the community. The future of Linux desktop is being written. Be a part of it. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more Linux content. See you in the next one. Peace out.